Hey guys, welcome back to another more food video with me and James. And James. Me and James. So this is James and Shane's nut free granola. So nut free granola because we can't have nuts where in where can't you have nuts? In school? Yeah, we all know you can't bring nuts into school these days, so this is a simple granola recipe that we use with the kids here um, and they take to school nearly every single day um, with some Greek yogurt, okay? So it can be put into their lunch. Now, James is currently mixing all the mixture because we put it all together, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so James, you have to tell everyone now and you have to shout it, tell everyone what we put in here. So the first thing we put in was... No, first, first thing we put in was, what are these? Oats. Oats, porridge oats. So one pound of porridge oats, guys. Um, measure it out, one pound of porridge oats. That's a lot of porridge oats, right? After that then, we've got, how many Weedabix did we use, James? One more. Three? Three. Three Weedabix. And what did you do with them then? We put them in here. And you? Crunched them up with your hands. So three crunched up Weedabix with the one pound of porridge oats. I'm reading off of my list now because this is my wife's recipe, that's not mine. So I'm reading off my list. After that then we done six tablespoons of olive oil. Olive oil. Olive oil, yeah. And then we did six tablespoons of honey. Of lovely honey. And then we did four tablespoons of rice. Is it rice? Yeah. Coconut. Coconut. Four tablespoons of coconut, the desiccated coconut. And we also had in there two tablespoons of brown. Brown. Sugar. Brown sugar. And now James is mixing it all up. He's mix, 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 mix. As hard as he can, he's going to get all that mixture together. Now, once James has that all mixed together, how's it going? Good. Is it hard? Yes. Hard work. Yes. You build your muscles. Yes. Show everybody your muscles. No, no, two hands. Oh, they're getting so, so big. Okay, so once James has that all mixed up, it goes on to a baking tray on some parchment paper. Okay, spread it all out evenly onto the baking tray. It's going to go into the oven for um, 10 minutes, but you want to check it at least three times in the 10 minutes, okay? So at least three times, you're going to open the oven, move the stuff around with a, with a spoon og. Yeah, move everything around with a spoon og so that the edges don't get burned. And then when, when it's done, and you're happy with it, it's nice and brown, um, take it out, add in some raisins, okay? Just add in the raisins, and then put it back into the oven with the heat off, okay? That way the raisins won't burn. Now, obviously you can add in your own nuts and seeds, and if you want, a, a, if you, if you want to have a granola with nuts in it, or without it, you just take them out, obviously. The seeds we'd add in as well, we just don't have any here today. So James, what are we going to do next? Um, put it in the oven. Put it in the oven. We're going to put this in the oven. We'll take a picture of the finished product for you guys. That is James and Shane's... Nuff. <laughs> nut free <laughs> granola. <laughs> Say nut free granola. Nut free granola. <laughs> Give me a high five. Say bye to everybody. Bye. Bye. Catch you on the next video, guys.